Hey guys and welcome back to my test world. Now, uh, what I have for you today is a Minecraft's smallest combination lock. And not only is it the smallest, but it can have an unlimited amount of codes that un opens an unlimited amount of doors. So, for example, with one with one uh, keypad, I can I've set it up here to open three doors. But let me just show you a nice, nicer way uh, or a nicer version of it in action. Right. So first off, I've got this little temple. Oh, hello, Mr. Bat. Okay. So basically, the code for the temple. Oh man, I can't remember now. Um, it is one, two, one, two, two, uh, one and one up there and there we go whoa whoa i've got a bat infestation batman oh okay sorry it's been a long day um okay yeah so as you can probably guess how this works is that um i'm using the new scoreboard system so on the right hand side i've got something called lock and then when the lock is a particular score the door will open so in this case um the score is let me just really get that for you um but, 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 but one more it's 220 okay so you you would have seen adding and subtracting and so forth so basically how this works uh, so maybe this is the temple of the bat oh i like that let's just put this on here um temple of the bat uh, sorry, I'm getting sidetracked here. So, but just just uh, temple of the bat. Okay, cool. Anyway, so this is it. It's buttons that that uh, activates the the command blocks. Uh, I have a custom objective set up that is lock, right? And then all I'm doing is I'm scoreboard uh, for the players remove the, from the nearest player, which is within ten radius of this command block. Uh, remove 27 from the objective lock right so you'll see uh, I've really just added absolute random things so there is uh, add 8 uh, there is uh, add 41 uh, there is remove 24 uh, here is remove 18 uh, there is uh, add 135 so I completely and utterly randomized the numbers and the numbers can be as big as you want I mean the more weird and unique the numbers is the better this is going to work so when you press on these buttons it'll add and subtract as I said before uh, to, to your score to reach a particular amount of, uh, of score <laughs> um, and then it will open the door so all I have at the bottom here is um, one test for command that says test for uh, the objective lock that the score is equal to 220 okay so if the score is over 220 it won't work and then we want to say is score uh, check the score for the objective lock 2 that it that it's at least 220 so this is no more than 220 this is at least 220 you need both in there um, otherwise it might it will open for example if you have only the minimum it'll open for any uh, amount above 220 now oh uh, okay now I do have a, it looks like I've got a quite a complicated setup here but what this really just is is this one uh, just clears so you'll see this is uh, set uh, any for any player that's at that coordinates in a radius of three uh, the objective of lock two to zero so it just kind of clears it so that I don't walk around with it so this one clears it when I go through those front doors and this one clears it when I'm uh, roughly about where these pistons are so when I walk through it it clears it and it closes the door okay so um, this can be anywhere in the world once again you can have your keep your your keypad here and that can be absolutely anywhere as long as both chunks are loaded Okay, especially this chunk here. So what I've got set up here is on this one keypad, I now have three combinations that will unlock each one of those doors individually. Okay, so you'll see this is it. This is the receiver. It's just test fours. Now I'm just scared I'm going to break these blocks. I don't know, something's wrong with my mouse. Okay, so literally it's just a test four that the score, this one is minus five. So each door has its own score that it'll test for. Okay, so let's test it so over here is my my codes so for the for the red door I need three 
uh, oh, sorry, two two clicks in the middle, one, one, and two. So it's two, one, one, two. So it's two, one, one, two. So it's two, one, two, one, one, and then two over here. And this will open the red door. There we go. Red door has opened. So if I now clear, clear my score, the red door will close. Now we want to open the green door. The green door is 312. Okay, so it's 312. So it's 1, 2, 3, 1, and 2. Voila! The green door has opened. Fantastic. Um, and then the blue door is 3, 1, 2, 1. So it's 3, 1, 2, 3. What did I say here? Sorry. 3, 1, 2, 1, 3, 1, 2, 1. Voila! You have an fully functioning uh, multi-code multi -code combination lock for Minecraft and this is the size of it it is tiny 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 and as I said this could be anywhere in the world cool guys if you enjoyed this please rate comment subscribe and let me uh, yeah let me know what you think of it um, I'm there is a lot more I'm going to be doing with this I've literally just started with it um, so yes, yeah, stay tuned for loads and loads and loads more. And uh, as always, I will catch you all later.